Uh, my name is Sean Galbraith. I'm one of the owners of Gallery DK, and this exhibition is called Photo Lab Photography by Anyone for Everyone. Gallery DK is uh, that's the home gallery of the DK Photo Group. Um, it's five photographers who specialize in urban decay photography. Uh, primarily abandoned building and architectural work, uh, but uh, we make the space available to other photographers who uh, um, not necessarily do urban decay, but do urban photography and urban uh, what we call lens-based art. For this show, we wanted to we, we wanted to do a show that would um, that would get a lot of exposure first of all, and get a lot of people you know participating in the show. Um, and to do that, we had an open call that went out to a number of arts mailing lists and anybody could submit up to three for free. Um, we sort of saw it as uh, an extension of the democratiz democratization of digital photography. Um, it's extending that to the, to the gallery realm. Uh, in total, we had around 70 or 80 photographers submitting and we've received around 270 photos in the show. We've been completely overwhelmed. It's been amazing. Well, do you have any submissions in here? Uh, I actually, I didn't submit. We didn't have room for me. No, no room for you? I see, other, some, I see some room over there. Yeah. Behind the bar. Yeah, it's usually, usually where mine are, nice and hidden. It What's was this? completely open theme. Uh, we only had two requirements. Uh, one was that the photo be 8x10 in size and the other that the, uh, the frame be no bigger than 20 inches on the long side. Other than that, it was completely open to the, uh, the individual artist's interpretation. I really think there's something for everyone in this show. And if you can't find something in here you like, then... You're actively trying not to find something you like. Yeah. Because everything that you could possibly like in photography is basically in this show. Every piece in the show is selling for $200. Um, and uh, it goes again with the sort of theme of democratization of, uh, of photography and photography exhibition. Uh, but that's pricing too. I mean, you, it's not only now is it a show that's accessible to any artist, but from a buyer's point of view, you now any piece is affordable. What, what's coming up next? Um, in what are we doing in January? In January, the plan is um, to basically whoever. The, the artists that sell the most have sell two or three pieces. We're going to ask if they want to come back, uh, four of them, to rent uh, three or four pieces of the wall uh, and have them basically have a best of show. We do have a television series coming up on Bravo. Um, should debut in the fall of 2009. The six half-hour episode series, um, following the five owners of the gallery uh, through um, old Europe uh, in a variety of abandoned buildings, and sort of what we do and how we do it and why we do it. I mean, it's us doing what we do, um, exploring buildings, taking pictures. Um, acting like buffoons, falling down hills. Mm -hmm. um, you get that on. You get that on film. Oh hell yeah! Oh, oh, nice. Nice. Full HD. <laughs> <laughs> no, we didn't no. have permission to be in any of the buildings we were in. We did. We did run away from two lingerie models in Belgium. Does that does that fall into like the uh, urban landscape? <laughs> Generally not. Uh, the occasional <laughs> raccoon, crackhead, you know, that sort of thing. Naked, not so much. No.